Hello, Acadiana. Thanks for joining us. Many Clico customers around Acadiana are burning up with high utility prices. News 10's Rodrigo Taylor spoke to the company about the ways they are trying to help customers reduce their bills. She joins us live in the studio. I have a bill from one of Clico's customers who says her bill totaled to over $2,000. Many people just like her just want to know why. When I think about it, I just want to cry. Charlie Gordon says she lives along with her pets. Her electricity bill is over $2,000. This is my first time having a bill this high. I'm not sure why it went up. I thought maybe my meter was broken. She says since her bill has increased, it is difficult for her to pay her other bills. I've been having problems paying the bill because it, it, it went up to almost $600 since May. Every month it was almost 600 She is not alone. Another person shares with News 10 how their bills have increased. You know, we have a two, it's almost $300 electric bill. You know, that's less food that we have to put on the table. Christopher Sneed says his parents are trying everything to reduce their costs. My dad writes on our bills, this is a bad bill. We just want to know what's going on, why, you know, why it's increasing. Fran Phoenix with Clico says two factors are playing into the increase, which are the weather, high temperatures, and fuel costs. It's like you, you, you can't say what the fuel rate is going to be, but you can't, the lower your kilowatt hour usage, the lower your fuel charge. She offers tips for customers such as keeping lights off and switching to LED light bulbs. Things like that with, that we don't think Think about, and we assume, oh, well, that's not making my bill high. But every little thing comes together, and it, then you have your kilowatt hour usage. And she says there are resources for customers. What matters is our energy efficiency campaign, but underneath it are all these programs that we have year round. If you have an issue with your bills, the company is referring people to call the call center. Rodrigo Taylor, KLFY, News 10.